G'day, Dylan O'Donnell here from the Byron Bay Observatory. Do you have eyepieces at home? Have you seen the different kinds of eyepieces you can get, but when you use them, you're concerned that you're not getting the most out of them? Uh, you've probably seen magazine photos where galaxies and nebula look colorful and bright, and you're wondering how you can get the best out of your eyepieces, because when you look through them, you see something more like this. Well, I've got some tips and tricks for you in order to understand how eyepieces work and how you can get the most out of them. My name is Dylan O'Donnell and you're watching Star Stuff. So here we have a beautiful two inch eyepiece. You can see that the hole at the end there is a lot larger and that lets a lot more of the image circle in. So you're gonna see more of the nebula or galaxy in this. Uh, this Orion one, however, is pretty nifty in that you can actually change the zoom. So you take a little bit of a hit to the brightness, but as you change the zoom, you can get a bigger or smaller picture of what you're looking at. Uh, however, there is one other trick that I can share with you uh, it's a little little tip that not many people know, but if you just take the eyepiece and get rid of it and buy a f camera, you lose. It. 